Ponte de Lima is a lovely riverside town, 26 km upstream from Viana do Castelo on the Lima River. The little community, which has less than 3000 residents, is Portugal's oldest villa, chartered town. It was granted a charter in 1125. The old bridge that spans the Rio Lima in this gorgeous riverside village is named after it. Since Roman times, this major crossing site on the river's southern bank has been an important crossing point. Although the present bridge was built in 1368, it has five arches from a much older Roman bridge. The medieval bridge originally had 17 arches, but three of them were destroyed when the riversides were built up over the years. While there aren't many things to do in Ponte de Lima, it's still a lovely, relaxing place to visit with plenty of charm. It's easy to imagine the town being a backwater, because it's deep in the Minho interior, yet that's far from it. There is something of an upmarket air to the place with surprisingly elegant granite buildings and some very pleasant cafe-lined squares, not to mention the riverfront area. While you're enjoying these awesome drone shots, don't forget to like and subscribe and ring the bell. We are posting videos like this twice a week and we would hate for you to miss it. <laughs> there are a variety of intriguing ancient structures and monuments to be seen when strolling around Ponte de Lima's twisting cobblestone streets. A few of reminders of the town's vital role in protecting the Minho against the Moors during the Middle Ages may be found among them. The modest 15th century Paso do Marques de Ponte de Lima, a castellated manor, sits just beyond the town center while the crenellated tower of Torre de Cadea Velha overlooking the river. This building, which was once part of the town walls, now serves as the local tourism office. Around town there are a variety of churches and chapels, the most well known of which being the Igreja de Santo Antonio. This is the whitewashed baroque style church with the characteristic bell tower that located just across the river from the bridge. The riverside is where it happens in Ponte de Lima. There are a variety of events held throughout the year, but the town is most known for its massive bi-weekly open-air market, the Feira Quenzenal. It is said to be Portugal's oldest chartered market, having been in operation since 1125 and still going strong. There are stalls offering a wide variety of things most of which triggering people that are looking for a different thing than usual. On the one hand, you'll discover cheap tat and phone accessories, but on the other, you'll find a variety of somewhat unsavory animal parts. To be fair, there is also a nice selection of fresh produce and high-quality textiles available. <laughs> 